part one of our Amsterdam adventure, we explored the local vending machines, sampled the greatest cookies in the world, and took in some fine art, as well as indulging in some of the local culture. It was a sombre early morning start which saw us exploring the Anne Frank house before taking cover from the predictably bad weather. We've just been to Anne Frank's hiding place. Yeah, it's nice it's nice nice there, and it's raining, so we're hiding in a place. On a boat. It's a holiday. Is now. Can you argue that we go on a boat every day because of the ferry? So. Yeah, but this isn't what your mum means by a boat trip. You know that. Okay, but this is. Yeah. Okay. The boat trip was a really great experience, despite the torrential rain, and should probably be viewed as an essential part of any visit to Amsterdam. We particularly enjoy catching sight of one of Mick Jagger's residences in the city, as well as the location used in Monet's painting, Canal in Amsterdam. Grabbing a late breakfast, we then made for the ferry terminal in order to reach the NDSM wharf. A repurposed shipyard, NDSM has become a cultural hotspot in the city, hosting a variety of exhibitions, festivals and art installations. Our first stop was Plek, a waterside restaurant housed inside a number of shipping containers. Stopping for a pint, we quickly decided that we'd venture back here later in the day for something to eat. From there, we made the short walk to the Strat Museum.
As evening drew in, we decided to walk back to the NDSM to take a few photographs of the old shipyard before grabbing a bite to eat a plek. I don't know what I'm going to do because we've ordered too much food, but they seem to know we've ordered too much food. And everyone else is eating burgers, I don't know what's going on. So, tell me about your meal. Oh gosh, there was so much of it. Is it good? It was really good. I had asparagus to start and um, potato and leek for my main and it was amazing, but it was like two main courses. In typical fashion, by the time we'd finished eating, the bad weather had made a return. As the ominous dark clouds began to clear and a hint of blue skies made an appearance, we made our way back into the city to get some breakfast. Positioned a stone's throw from the city centre, Hans Egstroff seemed the perfect place to try some stroop waffle. A lot of the fun derived from these videos can probably be taken from trying to guess when we're both absolutely trolleyed. Leave your suggested timestamp for such occurrences in the comments below. Needless to say, an impromptu visit to Amsterdam's Madame Two Swords may be a bit of a dead giveaway. It's like a, a much cheaper version of Madame Two Swords in London. Yeah. When I say cheaper, I don't mean we paid less to go in. <laughs> I yeah. mean, yeah. I think the wax works were just as bad in the London one. I'm not slagging off the London well, half one, but of that's. We were Dutch and we didn't know who they were. <laughs> I spotted the skater, so there's that. <laughs> Probably right. I had fun. Did you have a good time? I had a good time. We're on a tram. Um, mainly because we've, oh, yeah, we've walked all the way out here, so now we're attempting to get back to the station because it was quite a long walk. Oh, that's supposed to be one of the best breakfast places in Amsterdam. We are at Mother's Restaurant mm -hmm. and we're going to eat some food. Not our mother. No, not our mother. No. Okay. No. A smorgasbord of mothers. A smorgasbord of mothers. And it's the kind of food that mother would cook you. Okay. That's the... Not, not my, my mother. mother. Not my mum, not your mum. No. A no, Dutch Pretty mum. much, unless it was a Sanya or shepherd's pie, that, that was it. My dad did most of my cooking. Fish cakes and tomatoes. The food in Mother's, despite its simple nature, was incredibly good, although not necessarily terribly photogenic. Video now, isn't it? Video. Well done. We 
made our way back to the hotel, got trapped in the disco elevator for a while, and watched the sun set over the river. The end to another brilliant day. Ferry. Is it a video? I was just expressing my sadness. No, what? So we're back at the uh, croissant place. We're eating an apple flat this time. Mm -hmm. How's it rate? Good. And with that, our time in Amsterdam had come to a close. All that was left now was catching the train back to the airport and making for home. <laughs>